Right now at 6 o'clock, the local impacts of that nationwide E. coli outbreak are coming into clear focus tonight. We now know which local counties are reporting illnesses tied to that investigation into McDonald's quarter pounders. Good evening, I'm Bart Bidsoll. And I'm Heather Skoll. Thanks for joining us. We begin with developing news in the deadly E. coli investigation tied to McDonald's. State health officials confirm people in El Paso and Teller counties got sick after eating a quarter pounder. There are a total of nine Colorado counties impacted with at least 26 people sick and an elderly man from Mesa County on the western slope has died from an infection there. CARDIO 13's Tyler Cunnington joins us live after speaking to an expert with the state health department as well as a food safety attorney who's representing those in this outbreak. Tyler. Yeah, that's right, Bart and Heather. As Colorado continues to headline this E. coli outbreak with over two dozen cases and one death, we are now told by state health officials there are patients here in El Paso, but also nearby Teller County, although it still remains unclear which specific restaurant locations led to all those people getting sick here in the Pikes Peak region. 26 Coloradans, including people in El Paso and Teller counties, contracting E. coli. The outbreak, according to federal health officials, caused by contaminated slivered onions used on the quarter pounder burger at McDonald's. Hi, we are using our work today. Disease experts with the state of Colorado say the trend became apparent in mid-October. Data telling us that these cases were highly, highly related or their, their bacteria was highly related that helped us uh, confirm that this in fact was an outbreak. An outbreak from those burgers that now spans 10 states, including Nebraska, that's where renowned food safety attorney Bill Marler is representing two people who ate at McDonald's. Consumers go to restaurants not expecting to get poisoned. He says a lawsuit will likely focus on whether McDonald's or the supplier of those onions is at fault. If it is found that the onion supplier supplied them contaminated onions, so they can say, yes, it's my fault, I served you the hamburger, but the onion supplier needs to pay for it. Now, state health officials say if you've re recently eaten a McDonald's quarter pounder and are, and are feeling symptoms of vomiting, diarrhea, high fever, as well as stomach cramps, you're encouraged to contact your health provider to get tested as soon as you can. Reporting live here in Colorado Springs, Tyler Cunnington, KRDO 13. Hopefully they will. Tyler, thanks.